So, as you probably know, horses can't enter Gerudo Desert in Breath of the Wild because there's an invisible wall in the way. After getting a horse onto the Great Plateau, I thought maybe I could fly over the arch that enters the desert. Uh, unfortunately, that invisible wall extends further to the sides than you expect, even if you strafe along the edge. So, my next idea was to climb the mountain from a different side and get in that way. I used the giant horse for its bigger reach, and just when I thought things weren't going to work out, I got hit by a very convenient electric keys, which damage boosted my horse just a little further up a cliff, and that allowed me to get over the mountain. Unfortunately, I didn't catch that part on video, but I'm pretty sure a lightning arrow would do the same thing. Anyway, after sidestepping around some cliffs and sliding very carefully down a few steep slopes, I finally made it here to the desert, and the result was less than exciting. Yeah, the horse just whinnies and disappears. I thought maybe that it was just this particular spot, but I also got the horse down to where the sandstorm makes the map go fuzzy, and the same thing happened there. So basically, any time the horse touches the ground inside the desert region, it will just disappear and respawn back into the closest location that was not in the desert. I tried feeding it apples, shooting it with ice arrows, whistling to it, uh, hitting it, riding it, and uh, nothing really works, so that kind of kills that idea. But hey, at least we know now. Oh, and by the way, if you try to go through the back entrance of the Yiga hideout, uh, there's another invisible wall for the horse, so womp womp. <laughs> 